There are new fears that microplastics found in food, drink, clothing and the air we breathe could trigger heart disease. Melbourne researchers are investigating if the tiny particles could be damaging the blood vessels that keep arteries healthy. Microplastics and nanoplastics are everywhere. They've been found at the top of Mount Everest and also in Antarctica and they've entered the food chain through the environment. The tiny plastic particles could be hurting our hearts. They're getting into the body, they're small enough to be absorbed and they're appearing in various organs including the coronary arteries. Researchers have found when plastics enter the body, immune cells try to kill them. As a last resort, the immune cells self-destruct and explode on the microplastics, releasing a toxic cloud of DNA and proteins. And while the tiny plastics remain intact... The surrounding cells, the healthy cells, can get affected. When it comes to the heart, plastics could be causing inflammation, swelling and the build-up of plaque, making it hard for blood to flow through the blood vessels, increasing the risk of a heart attack, blood clots and stroke. Early findings indicate different types of plastic could cause more harm. Some seem to have more of an effect on immune cells than others. Experts are hoping the study paves the way for new treatment options for this specific type of inflammation. We've got some early clues from some uh, work with drugs that are used for arthritis. Uh, which might be effective. This research project will take years, but what's clear already is that it will take action from governments globally to reduce plastic pollution. But there are things we can all do now to limit our exposure. Starting at home with food and drink in plastic containers. Especially avoid um, combining that with heat, so microwaving or using boiling water.